A new lawsuit is set to challenge Iowa's new immigration law. It comes about a month after Governor Reynolds signed it into law. KCCI's Alyssa Gomez is following this for us this morning. Alyssa, this is a joint lawsuit from a few different organizations. Yeah, Eric, Alex, the ACLU and the American Immigration Council plan to announce the lawsuit this afternoon. They're calling Iowa's new law unconstitutional and discriminatory. Now, that new law makes immigra illegal immigration in our state a crime. So if someone who was denied entry into the state or was previously deported, state law enforcement is allowed to arrest them. It also gives Iowa judges the power to deport them. The groups suing the state say the law encourages racial profiling and stereotyping. They also say it puts a strain on law enforcement entities that already lack resources. And in a statement to KCCI, Governor Reynolds defends the law, saying, quote, the only reason we had to pass this law is because the Biden administration refused to enforce the laws already on the books. She added that she has a duty to protect the citizens of Iowa. Law is set to go into effect July 1st. The Department of Justice is also considering filing a lawsuit against Iowa. They did so to Texas, who just passed a similar immigration law. Live in Des Moines, Alyssa Gomez, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.